You rat! Come out and fight like a man! <laughs> I don't think so. I like it better right here. But you'd rather hide behind my wife like some mangy whelp? I could just as easily cut her throat! I have hostages enough. And strong walls to protect me. Bring him here! Radzig? What do you want, you viper? Let me think. Oh, actually, there's nothing I want from you. Except maybe to see you all die. Fire! Burn it down! Christ. Uh, are you all right? Uh, I'll live. Oh. Whew. But I don't think I'll be wielding a sword for a while. Oh, we have men enough for sword wielding. A good lord is harder to come by. Hmm. How the hell did they get Radzik? I didn't make it to the gate. He was charging against reinforcements from the castle. We have to save Sir Rab my father, somehow. And we have to save my wife and get our home back. My friend, I think you know as well as I, we have to lay siege. No, no, that is our last resort. We have to try all our other options. Sir, if a few men could scale the Western Wall after dark, maybe they could get inside, free the hostages, and open the gate. That is, if they're holding them in the courtyard, as we've always done. Well, that's a big if. What if they're seen and they can't raise the portcullis quietly? Sir Hanish, if we can save just one hostage. It's a perilous undertaking. Who would you send? I'll go. Then let us make ready.
I'd better get ready for the night raid. Some light clothing would be best. Damn. Dark colors. I'm ready. Are you sure? You should wear lightweight black clothing. Yes. May the Lord watch over you. If any of you are having second thoughts, this is your last chance to speak. Very well. So I hope we're all clear on what has to be done. We need to free the hostages to deprive Toth of his advantage. Now he'll be keeping them somewhere where they can be guarded, but somewhere separate from his other men. And where would that be? We always kept our captives in the house on the bailey by the stables. Uh, what if they're in the tower or, or somewhere else? Then we'll have to go to the gate and try to open it. But that will take time and attract attention. So we can only do it if we know exactly how things stand. And if they sound the alarm before we've done anything, we get out of there quick. Understood? And leave them there? Better a couple of hostages than a pile of corpses. Lord Capon, are you quite certain you want to engage in this action? Quite. After all, it can't be much different from sneaking out of the upper castle in Rattay and back in every night. <laughs> Besides, who else will keep this hothead from raising bloody mayhem? Well, see to it that you do, my lord. May God guide our footsteps. We'll go first and take out the sentries. Wait here. Is that some new kind of game? Still two guards on the Port Callus winch to deal with. Any volunteers? Henry will do it. For food? Henry then. Just make sure you keep quiet. Him up for it. 
I'll find you. Hey, you all of you! Can't hide here. from me. Raise the alarm! First, we have to find the hostages. Then we can come back and deal with the rest. Easy now. We're almost there. Let's not fuck it up at the eleventh hour. We're Sir Ratzik and Lady Stephanie. The Lady Stephanie? She's not here. She must be held somewhere else. Where? Where is she being held? And where's Sir Ratzik? I suppose the lady might be in her chamber. We'll have to go back empty-handed. We're not going anywhere. Then how are we meant to find them? They're not in the stables or anywhere nearby. Yes, 
It was hard enough getting this far, but going inside is madness. Then we mustn't get caught. Listen, Hal, I can appreciate your stubbornness, usually, but this could cost us our heads and... I suppose you're right. It would be foolhardy to go on. Well, I'm glad you've come. Let's get the hell out. Come on, then. Let's get the fuck out of here before they catch us. Gorova! Fuck my ass! Fuck. Um, we'll have to carry him out of here right seriously. now. This is not very comfortable. Can't you stop hopping around with me? Over here! Oh, Listen, here. everyone, quick! <laughs> no. Run, for Christ's sake, and don't shoot so much. Quick! They're right behind us. That is behind you. They're in front of me, and I can't do anything. Alarm! If you don't get a move on... He'll stab you in the back, right under my nose. Hey, all of you, gather here. Raise the alarm. Run, for Christ's sake, and don't Raise shoot the so alarm. much. Watch out. I have to admit, we didn't do too well. True, the shame of it. They drove us back before we even got anywhere. Well, I wouldn't go that far. If pigs had wings... I know it troubles you, but it's not over yet. It seems, Robard, that we're running out of options. We don't have enough men to scale the walls with ladders. And we can't afford to lose any more. We can only take Talmburg by a ruse or with superior numbers. Ruses have failed, and we don't have superior numbers. Then we are left with no choice but to build a trebuchet. To demolish my own walls. <sighs> Where is Master Faithor? He's waiting. We sent for him as soon as... Bring him to me. Let's not waste time. Sir Divi. You will build me a trebuchet, Master Tobias. Uh, uh, a trebuchet, my lord? That's not entirely in my field of expertise. We have to take back Talmberg. Yes, indeed, sir. I understand and that. you but... are the best engineer we can rely on in the whole fiefdom. Oh, well, thank you, my lord. But it's, it's just that I've never built a trebuchet before. It's, this could take some time. Then you'd better get to it. Bernard will go over the plan of attack with you. Uh, I... Uh... Uh... Oh. Well, Master Tobias... You have much to do in little time. I will not keep you any longer. Indeed. Of course, sir. Thank you, my lord. How are the preparations proceeding in the other camps? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. There are still many things that need doing, but I just don't have the time for them. Mm. No, you don't. Henry. Yes, sir. I would like for you to help with the preparations and the encampments. Gladly, sir. Robard will brief you. That'll be all. Have some trophy. Show me. Good work. 
What needs to be done? Look, a military encampment's a complicated thing. When you walk around a the camp, they're moaning they've drunk the alehouse dry, and now they have to wait for the next batch of beer. The less the troops grumble, the better off we'll all be. What do you mean? Did you hear what Sir Jivish was saying to Fafar? I heard some of it. And what did you make of it? He said he'd never built a trebuchet catapult. I wouldn't even know where to start, but he might. But, if it'll take him as long as he said, we can't wait until Judgment Day, we don't ha I'll try to ask him if I can help in some way. You should definitely do that. How are you faring, Sir Raybard? How do you think I'm faring, lad? Well, at least no one's raised Talmud. Not so far. I imagine Sir Divish isn't taking it too well. And why do you think he handed command over to me? But it pains my heart, too. What's the easiest? The easiest way? <laughs> Call in the Royal Army and leave it to them. But there's no Royal Army to help us now, and we can't afford to wait. What's more, we don't want to destroy the castle. Personally, I'd like to return to it. Repairing the castle would be expensive. And time-consuming. No trebuchet is wholly on target. Do you think Sigismund will come back? How do I know what's in his head? But if he doesn't take advantage of this chaos, someone else probably will. I'd never have thought so many people were keeping an eye on Talmberg. But Not only Talmberg, and we've left precious few men in retire. If we're defeated here, who's to stop them from pillaging the whole province? And what about the war? The south and east are solid. It's best if... From the west is where we tried it, and got royally fucked. Is there some way? There are steps from the gate up to the walkway on the battlements, and I don't know how Istran's covering them. Then there's the portcullis to get through. A big battering ram might breach it, but how could you get one that close? I reckon we'll have to set fire to it. Stuck up brushwood and light it? Brushwood, timber, anything that burns, soaked in as much pitch as possible. And even if it doesn't burn the gate right down? Exactly. Pity they didn't stay holed up in Vranik for longer. Toth is a wily fox. If he'd had all his men with him there, there would have been real carnage. Is there anything? Well, we need some pit. I've met. Then have a look around. I'd like to get better. Certainly. I want to achieve. You can't become a master. I'd like to hone. First, you have to. I Wouldn't you rather? I'd like to practice. All right. Now, pay close attention. God bless you. What tr Sir Robard sent me to you. Indeed. A trebuchet that can smash the walls of Tamburg. I'll never money. Well, I'd like to help you, but... Actually, Conroy Kieser came to Sasso recently. All right. Thank you, Henry. God be with you.
My respects to you. Do you happen to know the whereabouts of Conrad Kieser? And what do you want from me? Ah, never mind. What do I care? Good luck to you. Oh, come on. What are you trying to... Good health to you, sir. Is this where Conrad Kieser lives? Indeed. I need to speak to him. Oh, really? I'm a fellow thinker and I... <laughs> Stronghold construction. That sounds important. Here's the key. the horde of Joshua, you startled me. I thought you were urban. What do you want? Sir, Tobias Fafar, the master builder and engineer from Scalitz, sends his greetings. Fafar? Tobias Fafar? I've heard of him. Sir, have you heard what's been going on in Talmberg? I've heard a thing or two. It has, and we want to take it back. Master Fafar has been given the task of building a trebuchet, but he's not sure he can manage it. I doubt it myself. Uh, building siege engines is an entirely different kettle of fish than mining. Damn, I'd like to rain some boulders on those heathens of Sigismund's. But that can't be done with a quill and parchment, and I can't leave here right now. Why can't you leave? That's a long story. And it might surprise you to know, after that defeat, he didn't particularly appreciate my criticism. Then, when Sigismund abducted the king, I didn't feel too secure in Prague, so I left. Hmm, perhaps left is the wrong word. Uh, some might say I was banished. It they locked you up in Bethlehem? <laughs> Not quite. It's a royal castle. Uh, they leave me to my own devices there. Frankly, this so-called banishment has been a bit of a blessing, although I have lost quite a few of my patrons thanks to all this unrest. And why are you here in Sassar? To be honest, I need the money. Money, sir? Dear me, no. I don't need it to support myself. It's to fund my opus. Could I not just pay off the Master Builder for your services? I doubt it. Carol is only interested in the construction. Ah. Yes. What? Could I help you escape, perhaps? Who says I want to? But you said you couldn't leave, sir. Young man, I can't leave because I gave my word I'd help with the building of the monastery here. And my word is my bond. Couldn't Carol be persuaded somehow? I realize that, but Sassar Monastery has always kept its neutrality. But I might... What do you... Carol received his commission in writing. If you found it, we could... That's a... <laughs> My inventiveness has many applications. How do I get... It will be somewhere in his quarter. I suggest waiting until evening. 
He's fond of his ties. Right. I hope I can be a... Are you sure you won't release Conrad? Not a chance. Hmm. Well, anyway, I've heard it said there's not enough money to finish the construction. So, I thought as a lover of architecture, I might contribute... How the hell do you know that? That's neither here nor there. How much will you give, Dad? Since it's you... That's not enough. Not a chance. Are you sure you? Not a chance. Hmm. How the hell? That's me. How much? Very well. It's been a pleasure. God be with you. To me. What? Who is? Leave? I can't even set foot outside the door. Not now. Please, come. <sighs> They're after me. Who? Sigismund's people, of course. Why would they be after you? Because he's never forgiven my criticisms of Nicopolis. What am I to do? What makes you? When I was on my way to Sassau, I saw Baron Pekar in Kostelitz. Now I've been told he was seen at the local tavern. And a stranger's been creeping around the gardens here late at night. They're after me, Henry. Take it easy. I don't know. He won't, I promise. You will, won't you?
Do you know anything about our master Paycar? That nobleman that you... Farewell. respects to you do you know anything that nobleman god be with you good day to you do you know anything i'm afraid not My respect to you. Do you know anything about the uh, rings of nah? Take care now. God be with you. Do you know any I'm afraid. May the Lord watch over you. Jesus. What are you Do you know anything? I'm afraid. I did. And? He's dead. He was an assassin, all right. Lord have mercy. Was it Pekar? Yes. I saw him all too clearly. So they are after me. I knew it. Come to Talmberg. You'll be surrounded by a whole garrison there. Yes. Yes, I suppose that does make sense. Uh, thank you, Henry. I'm in your debt.
A well-chosen sight. You want to strike the gate, do you? True. We don't want to do more damage than necessary. I quite understand. Sir Toth is holed up there, is he? Just so, Master Conrad. I hear you have some accounts to settle with him. Ah, not entirely. I've done with him. Sigismund trusted him more than me in his campaign against the Ottomans, and we all know how that ended up. Uh, how did it end up? Badly, my lord. The flower of French knighthood was slain there. Sigismund fled for his life, and I did too, I must confess. Be assured we shall not make the same mistake here. We do not intend to starve them into submission, but to break down the gate. I am at your service, my lords. We will build the trebuchet quickly. It will be ready in a matter of days. And I can supply, for example, Rocketta to sweep the foe from the battlements. Rocketta? I do not believe I've heard of such a term. Rocketta are missiles filled with black powder with a touch hole at the bottom to ignite it. They shoot forward, something like a hand cannon, but without rocks. The rocket is the missile. I see. But we don't have black powder in these parts. Nor cannon. Indeed. It should have occurred to me. But I am very fond of Rocketta, and I always think what Alexander the Great might have accomplished with them. I understand. We find ourselves in a conventional situation that demands a conventional solution. I'm still hoping that Toth will see sense and parley with us. He may well do so, especially when we set up the trebuchet on his doorstep. <laughs> 